Okay, guys. Well, this is it. This is our home. It's a beautiful planet, isn't it? Even with all this debris floating up above it, waiting to rain down on our cities. We really only have ourselves to blame for that. And thankfully, it didn't wipe us out. This is the home planet of our species, the only one we've ever known. We've spent our entire existence down on that planet. Until the Paranid came, however, and saved us. Saved us from ourselves, at least. We can't truly say they saved us, because they did bring us into something much bigger than we had ever dreamed of. There's, rather, there's a massive war going on out there right now. Let's check the sector map. This is where we are in the very center split fire. We've got the Argon Empire to the north and pirates to the east and to the south. Priest's Pity has been taken over by the Pirate Guild. It used to be a, a Paranid sector, but still is. Pirates haven't, haven't claimed it completely. But they've been battling it out down there. Priest's Ring is, I believe, where we do most of our trading at. We have a few of our trade ships down there. But the Paranid, uh, Paranid supply lines have been heavily disrupted by the Yaki, who have been pressing in from the west, it looks like. They've almost completely taken over Empire's Edge. Actually, they have. It says Yaki is now the primary owner of that, that sector. I don't know what the Argon Argon ships are doing. Recon, They're probably scouting this zone, making sure that we are abiding by the treaties. We're not supposed to be harboring any uh, any Paranid stations in here, or any Paranid fleets. Not unless we want to bring the wrath of the Argons, Terrons, and ATFs on us, just yet. For now, we are kind of a neutral sector where everyone can come and do trade. Uh, use, our, use our jump gates to jump around various points of the galaxy without having to traverse through enemy territory. We're in a very pivotal sector here. It's kind of why we think the parent had helped to lift us up. They didn't have the resources to take us over completely. They built us up so that we could stand guard for them. More or less on the front gates. And we will, too. Uh, what do we have for ourselves here, though? We've got a few stations. We've got two solar power plants. Um, we've also got a trading station. A trading dock somewhere around here. Let's see. Might help if I follow the icons. There's our two solar power plants. They don't get much trade. A lot of the capital ships nowadays have uh, technology that allows them to create energy cells uh, from their leftover energy. So solar power plants are slowly fading out of usefulness. Let's see, I think that's our trading dock there. We don't have any supplies, any goods on it yet. Trading dock. Once we get some good supply lines figured out, we'll set our traders to bring wares back here. We'll start selling them ourselves. There's our Corvette, the Merry Melter. What does it look like? It's kind of a funky design. It's an experimental Corvette. Parent would want us to test it out in battle for sector defense. It won't be jumping around very much. We've got two more of them flying around. We've also got the carrier, the Valcon Prime. 41 of our pilots on there. And that's also going to be for sector defense. Probably won't be pulling our fleet from here to any other sectors unless it's absolutely required. But it really is going to be up to you guys. I think I mentioned before, this is going to be kind of the interactive series I, I attempt to. It's not going to be as interactive as Variax does. Um, I'll take your guys' ideas. Of course, I'm going to weigh them against what uh, my own desires. And if I don't get any good ideas, any ideas that I, I actually like or think that we can do, I'll just do my own thing. I'll let you know if, if I dislike your ideas, though. I'll be honest with you as long as you guys be honest with me. There are a few things we could do. Right now, our sector is rather quiet. I haven't seen any enemy activity. No, no cause, Xenon or pirates have come through for a while. We do have the, the pirates to the south that we could take care of. 
I haven't scouted there for a while, so they could have built up a whole lot more. They could also have been pressed out and the parent it might have taken back over. Priest ring, that's all trading. We could also go to Empire's Edge and declare war on the Yaki and try to help help the Paranid push them out, but I don't think we have the forces for that yet. We could also start going to the north, exploring some of the Argon sectors and seeing what they're up to. Or just going over here and trying to find out what's going on with the rest of the Paranid Empire. Let's get a quick overview of the war war showing. We'll see what we'll see what the races are up to. Improved races is what I'm using. And let's see. We own this sector. We do collect taxes from the ships that pass through, as well as from uh, the sales and trade of, of our stations that we have around here. They don't get used much, but it's enough to turn a little bit of a profit. Uh, the Ka have taken over three sectors. They've taken over Bright Profit, Company Strength, and Freedom's Reach. And they're pressing in a lot more sectors. Looks like they're focusing the primary forces of their attacks on the Argon and Terran fleets. Xenon have taken over Menelao's Paradise, Getsu Fume, and a couple unknown sectors. It looks like they're building up in Nopolo's Memorial, 236 ships there. I'll try to stay clear of that. Yankee says they haven't taken over anything, but they're pressing on all the Paranid Empire as well. Looks like they're also pressing on Paranid Prime with 47. Got Shores of Infinity, Empire's Edge, Hatifus Faith, and Savage Spur that have all been taken over by the improved races. A couple counter strikes are being being launched. Looks like the Split Empire has two massive counter strikes going on, and the Paranids have only managed to gather four ships to go towards Meton's refuge. Hot War enemy reputations. I don't know if this is what how the enemies feel towards me or who these are related to. I'm thinking it's gotta be towards me. But if so, that means the Talati doesn't really like us, and the pirates don't really like us. No active capital ships out, and sector ownership. Split owns the most, followed by Argon, Terran, and Talati. Paranid only owned 27, and they're slowly losing them. We own one, down there with the Goners. We're in good company with them. Let's see the hot war. Argon has one enemy. Apparently they're at war with the Paranids. And they're of course they're friends with the ATF and Terrans, I think. I'm not sure if I set that up or if it was already like that. Pirates are enemies with everyone. ATF has five enemies, Terran has five enemies, Yaki has three enemies. We don't have any enemies yet. Except pirates, you know. Pirates AI. Just the usual stuff. So what do you guys think we should do? Should we still should we go trade? Should we go through the south gate, take some of our fleet with us, and try to flush out those uh, pirates? Should we go to Empire's Edge and scout around, and see what's going on over there? Or just start exploring some of these random sectors? And of course, you know that if you've also thought of something that I don't know. I'm not an expert at this game by any means. I mostly just play as a dogfighter, so things like running stations, uh, running empires, even that is a bit much for me. Go ahead and be, uh, be a desktop general. And this is our army. Where should we go?